Hey everybody, it's Sydney. Welcome back to my channel. It is my second video for Christmas in July. Giveaway details will be at the end of this video. So I'm going to go over another Christmas palette. Well, it's technically three palettes, but I'm going to be going over it with you. Too Faced Under the Christmas Tree Collection. Now, just like the Grinch palette, I haven't seen a whole lot of looks like on Facebook or Twitter or anything like that. So I'm kind of just going off. There's no inspiration whatsoever when it comes to this. So before, I obviously, like you guys know the drill, when it comes to eye looks, I did my face makeup already, my eyebrows, and I primed my eyes. Um, I did put on, because the one palette has like a bronzer and a blush and highlighter, I did put it on off camera because I'm trying to not make my videos be like super long. You know what I'm saying? So this is the little bronzer blush highlighter I used. One con I will say when it comes to this is that if you have a darker skin tone, it's not really going to work for you. So they should have maybe had like more, I don't know, like more of a variety when it came to this. Well, whatever. So these are the eyeshadow palettes. My lighting is extremely weird and it is not focusing. If you hear my kids in the background, I'm sorry. It is summer break and they are going crazy. So the one is this. It has a little plastic and it looks like that. And then the other one looks like this. So I'm going to be using both of these eyeshadow palettes to be creating a look. And so let's do it. So first I'm going to go in with Vanilla Snow and I'm going to put it all over my lid, over my primer. I'm just using this unique brush and Vanilla Snow and putting it all over my eye. Next, I'm going to go in with the color Winter Wonderland, and I'm going to take a JS6 brush, and I'm going to pop that in my crease. I lost the sheet for this palette. Somehow, I don't know how, but I'm going to take this pink color, kind of looks weird on my camera, but I'm going to pop that in the crease with the same brush, just over what I already did. So I'm going to take an Eco Tools brush and I'm going to go in with Dream Come True and I'm going to put it over the crease but a little bit lower. So now I'm going to take my trusted angled brush and I'm going to go in with this dark brown Pleasant Dreams and I'm going to pop it in my outer corner. So now that I've got that done, I'm going to go in with this pink color, it's like a pink shimmer, and I'm going to try it with a dry brush first, just putting it on this part of my eyelid. I am not really, I haven't used a lot of Too Faced stuff besides their brushes, so their eyeshadow is a lot different than what I'm used to. It blends out kind of weird, it doesn't, it's, but it's still good, like I like it, it's just different. So that actually worked really good. I'm mixing in some of the silver with on top of that shimmery pink.
So I'm going to take this liner brush. Don't know the brand. Like I said, I got it in BoxyCharm a couple months ago. And I'm going to go back in. I think it was called Pleasant Dreams. And I'm going to just pop it underneath. So I got the eyeliner on, so I'm going to take a Luxie 141, it's a mini round brush, and I'm going to go in with, I'm pretty sure this was called Beard of White, the top one, and I'm going to put it in the inner corner and underneath my eyebrows. I'm going to clean this up with some concealer, add some mascara and lipstick, and I will be right back. So I added some mascara, I cleaned it up with concealer, and I added some lipstick. Browns are my nude. And I have to say that this look is really cute. I wasn't really sure what to expect because a lot of people tell me that all of the like Too Faced palettes are the same. So basically, you only need one to get most of the colors they make. Um, and it's a little, the formula is a lot different than some of my other eyeshadows, but it looks really cute. Like to get that shimmery look I wanted, I mixed the pink and the silver. Overall, like this whole collection, it was really cute. And it did come with the mascara, but that mascara is expired because I got it seven months ago. Um, but it's really cute. It's really cute how it like turns, oh, they actually stick. They stick. Okay, so that is cute. I didn't even know that until now that they stick. Um, and it's like a little Christmas tree so you don't lose the palette. I've kept it in the box all this time because that's just how I am when it's like comes to seasonal makeup. So if you have this, I would love to see your looks. Comment them down below. I also have some giveaway details for you. So like I stated in my last two videos, you comment on this video and you get, you're automatically entered, but you do need to be subscribed to my channel. That's one of the things. I know that I, I don't want to say how many subscribers I am because I'm going to post this in a few days after I'm filming this, but I was up at 66 and then I went down to 63. Saturday is my day that I go through and I sub, I watch everybody's YouTube videos because I have two kids, it's hard enough to film and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But if you want to be entered in the giveaway, you do have to be subscribed. I have gotten a lot of nice comments. Um, I don't know if it's okay to give a shout out or not. If you want a shout out in my next video, go ahead and comment down below. I'll be happy to do so. I really want to thank you all for the nice comments. Once I hit 100 subscribers, there's another giveaway right there. It's like obviously a mystery when I hit 100. I'm going through all my subscribers, doing like a random drawing, and somebody will be chosen. So if you want to be entered, again, comment on this video. At the end of the video, I will have links to the other two videos that you can comment on. So you have three entries. And like I stated in my last video, I will go live on YouTube on the 31st, or no, not on the 31st. The 31st is when it ends, but I will go live at around noon on the 1st of August to say who is the Christmas in July winner, and that way I can get your address and send you your present and all types of stuff. So anyways, thank you so much for watching, you guys. I have a little cameo of two people who want to say hi to you. I'll be right back. These are my kids. It is summer break for my daughter. She is in second grade. This is my son. He loves to jump up and down. He is wild. He would, you probably heard him in the background. My daughter was being very nice and watching him for me. He loves his sister. He will not look at the camera. Hey, who's that? He loves her. He loves his sister. And he loves himself. Yes, he does. <laughs> So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. My daughter will tell you what you guys need to do. You need to, you need to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Turn that. What is it? No. Oh, <laughs> ring the bell. Yeah. yeah. Ring the bell. Ring the bell. She knows the all bell. about YouTube. Ring the bell so you can get a notification when we post a new video.
Yep. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.